This must be Lake Brescia. Well, I guess we fell from up there, and the lake turned to crystal? Help me out here. I mean, did the Falci do this? How in the world did we end up here? How should I know? <sighs> We're alive. How? Sarah! No one survives a fall from that high, not without a miracle. Sarah saved us! Sarah? Listen, it's all your fault. She got... Oh. Hey, 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 hey! Watch out! Why did I... this do? You used magic! Uh, uh. You used the power of the sea! The foul sea cursed us! We'll see now. Right. Hey everyone, it's Pi Nation here, and welcome back to another episode of Final Fantasy XIII. In the last episode, we took on Anima and uh, became Lassie. And in this episode, we're going to skip the tutorial because it's just talking about uh, basics here again. Like, since we're now able to see, we have abilities we can use and techniques we can use. Uh, but for now, we're not really going to get into them because we don't actually have any, to be honest. Like, abilities is just your normal. We do have things like Ruin and Blitz. Uh, Blitz we always have, but we have Ruin now, so that's cool. Um, and I'll explain what that golden bar is in the next episode. The uh, next episode, next time we get into a battle. Gosh. Um, now there may be a bit of an echo, um, because I can't do, turn down my TV because I've got a button lock on the TV, which is stupid, and I've got no batteries for my remote, so that's great. Oh. Oh. So we really are, let's see. Uh. Oh, looks like it. You too? Yep. Right here. Okay. Let's see to the last. <sighs> Why me? I don't even know you! Will you have to go and attack that thing? <clears throat> Just leave me alone! It's your fault. It's your fault, my... You could've. All of this is your and Sarah's fault! Watch it! <sighs> Sorry. Everything is gonna be alright. You'll see. Come on! Off we go! God damn it, computer. Anyways, as you might have noticed, I am no longer talking during the cutscenes again. Because even though I do talk over the cutscenes, I still get copyright claimed anyways. So there is no point to me actually talking over it. So, um, I'm going to be doing this let's play exactly how I want it now. Um, I might start doing that... Last time on Final Fantasy 13 thing, but I might actually just make it shorter just because I think it, it might have got a bit overboard. Um, I might do something like what Cry does, where he's like, last time, and then like does like a two second clip. Oh no. Okay, if we don't know our focus, how do we complete it? I think I saw it. Saw what? That 
is how a focus comes down, people. The Fauci, they don't spell it out with clear-cut instructions. All you get is a hazy glimpse. Hmm. Mm -hmm. Well, you know, that's what they say. You know, legends and all. Mm -hmm. Legends. Yeah. <laughs> Did you see anything? <sighs> I, uh... I just... It's all kind of foggy, but... I saw this big... I mean, towering... What? What? Wait a minute. Hold on now. Do we all have the same dream? Ragnarok. Ragnarok. So, we all saw the same dream. We all heard that same voice. You mean that was our focus? But how are we supposed to know what to do from that? Mm -hmm. That's the tricky part. The dream's the only hint the Falci gives us. Figuring out what to do with it, that's our job. Okay, okay. We're a pulse see, right? Enemies a cocoon. So, does that mean that our focus is... Are we supposed to save her? Say what? Our focus is to protect Cocoon. Really? Okay. And why's that? Sarah told us. Let's do it. We're all in this together. I'm gonna look for Sarah. She ought to be nearby. Uh, I'll come too! Wait! Jeez. Man, that boy can't stay still. Really? And with that... We can now get into the Christanium, yay! Skip that tutorial, because that's just useless. Anyways, in order to do the Christanium, you press Y or Triangle if you're on the PlayStation. And you go for stadium, and then you pick whatever part of me you want. So we're gonna start with uh, lightning here. When you open it up, they will have a certain like crystal to them, and you can either level them up during like one of their strengths, which has um, uh, lightning here has commando and ravenger. You can switch between the two mid battle and before and after battles. Uh, and each one is used for different purposes, but for now I'm going to make it go with the commando route because I want it to be pretty strong. Um, so basically what you do is just press A or X and hold it and it will just uh, put all your XP into a certain route and boom, done. If you played Final Fantasy X, you'll be somewhat familiar with this, just that Final Fantasy X was a bit more complicated than just pressing X. Um, so yeah, I'm just gonna go through these guys quickly, and I'm just gonna level them up in certain areas. Um, I well, computer, don't go to sleep. I'm pretty sure that messes my recording up. Um, I'm gonna have Snow level up in this department because um, um, there we go. Just because, uh, really. This is just his default that he does, um, and, okay, yeah, thought so. So once you get a whole area done, you'll have a crystal that goes down, you can then go down, or well, no, duh, and then it might end up being empty for a bit, but that's fine because it'll uh, later unlock some more places soon. Uh, so for now, that's all we can really do with him, I'm pretty sure, unless... Yeah, that's all we can do. So let's move on to Vanille. Um, I won't be showing all of these all the time. Um, I What I'm going to do is if it's... If there's no story going on, like how we're just about to start into a big story arc now, um, then I will probably show the upgrading I'm doing, but otherwise I'll be showing them at the end of each episode at the end slate. So yeah. And let's see here, 
Now, um, as far as I know, you want to have, uh, what's his name, Hope, really working in Medic and Synergist, whatever that is. I'm going to have him in, wait, what does Medic give him? 10 HP, Strength 3. 10 HP, Magic 3, Magic 15, which he's already got. Yeah, I'm going to have him go down this route. Um, you can upgrade multiple um, traits at a time, so yeah, you don't have to worry about that. Yes, we do. Anyways, uh, let's... Whoops, did not mean to hit that. Go away. Let's come over this way quickly and battle these guys. Don't worry, I won't be showing these battles all the time. I'll start cutting them out probably from now on because this is a preemptive strike anyways and it's just going to be us beating the hell out of them. Yeah, see, it's easy as hell. You can just stagger the hell out of them. Sweet. Anyways, yeah, sorry about the long, like, period of time without uploading anything. Just been doing some other things around the place, and just sort of gone the way of recording. Uh, been meaning to do a recording session for a while, though. <coughs> anyway, so we come in here. Right, my cough's coming back, that's great. We can get a staff for What's-Her-Face. Um, Vanille. Gosh, I'm having trouble with names now. I uh, clip that. And as you can see, it's more of a magic thing. But for now, I'm not going to equip it because I don't want to using magic just yet. Maybe I'll equip it later when I have her doing like lots of healing. I'm not even sure if she's in the party. Yeah. Oh, she is in the party. You know what? I am going to equip it. I'm going to make her be a healer. Basically, you want to have Hope being your main healer for now. Um, I think he is the best for healing. I am not sure because, well, I haven't really played through this whole game. I've only played up to disc 2 and only a tiny bit of disc 2. So I am not sure what is the optimal thing to have everyone at. So this can be an experience for all of us, guys. Yay, another preemptive strike. I'm not sure how many of these I'm going to show. This oh, you know, this is going to be the last one. But I do need to talk about that glowing bar down there. That is your um, tactical points or technique points, whatever they're called. They allow you to do like your special techniques. Like if I go techniques, I can go Libra and cast and boom. But he was already dead, so they didn't really show anything. But... Techniques, just use technique points. As simple as that. So we're just gonna make our way up here. Whoop. Might I add, <laughs> I always loved the jumping in the 13 series. They just seem so unrealistic. Over here we have a chest. Now you may be wondering why I know all these chests are here. It's not because I know the game that well, it's actually because this is a failed recording. And no, this is not post-commentary, this is actually live. Um, but yeah, I had to re-record this at part. We fight it! Ragnarok! That's the reason we're Lassie. To stop it. To keep Cocoon safe! Yeah, why don't you give us one reason to believe that? One reason, Sarah. <laughs> she said to protect Cocoon, and then she turned to Crystal. That's the proof right there. She completed her focus. That means ours is to save Cocoon. Sarah's foul sea was the same as ours. Our focus has got to be the same. We were chosen to be guardians, to defeat Ragnarok. It makes sense. What the hell it does? You're grasping at straws, son. Post foul sea are Cocoon's enemies. We just got recruited by one of them. <sighs> if I were a betting man, I'd put us on the other side. 
So Sarah's an enemy too? Well, I don't buy it. We have the power to save Cocoon if we work together and carry out our focus. The Falci took Sarah from us, and you want to help it? Whose side are you on? Freeze! Huh? <sighs> Place your hands behind your heads! <sighs> you fall off the purge train? Maybe. Are you talking back to me? Huh? Huh? <laughs> nice gun. Command execution. Um, actually, I don't remember this. Abilities, pub. Press Y. Is that it? So let's go attack. Oh, is that it? Anyways, um, I am not talking right now, which is bad. So let's just, uh, I'm just gonna do auto attacks for most of the game, to be honest, because, well, um, when it comes to the battles, it's mainly about the timing of everything and also about the levels themselves. Um, when. They be tougher than that. This guy's a Psycom, yeah? Hmm. Supposed to be cream of the crop. Yeah, but Psycom's an anti pulse task force. They haven't fought a war in centuries. Bunch of rookie troops swinging around overpriced toys. So, from what you're telling me, Sounds like a regular old soldier has got more training than special forces. Nothing for us Lassi to be afraid of. Cut the crap. Their grunts might be green, but Psycom's elites are cold-blooded beasts. They hit the field and it's game over. Uh-oh. Then let's run away. Ciao! Wait, hey, hey wait! <sighs> <sighs> What's a man to do? <laughs> 